Hey guys, Hans Florine here. I'm a climber known for climbing this big rock here, uh, 3,000 feet, taller than the tallest building in the world. And I'm going to start and end with the same thing because I think it's so important. And that is that life is hard. And the harder you are on yourself, the easier life will be on you. Um, climbing El Cap is hard. It's really hard. In fact, um, I failed to climb it. I got to just here, just barely above the tree line after a full day of climbing and back down and came back a year later and then climbed the whole thing in two and a half days it took us to do it. A normal party takes three days or two and a half days to climb the route. Um, I have climbed it now in under three hours which is crazy um, and nutty. And I've climbed the route a hundred times. Most people climb it one time in their life. It's kind of like the Everest of rock climbing. But I've failed to climb it 15 different times where I've actually hiked to the base of this route, meant to get to the top, and had to back off for various reasons, from not enough food, not enough water, I wasn't strong enough, my partners and I didn't plan well enough, numbers of things. Um, I've climbed El Capitan, which is this whole rock, more times than any other person on the planet. I've also failed to climb it more times than any other person on the planet. Um, I feel really fortunate for these lessons of like, I don't know, successful people fail more than not successful people. Back to that hard things. Um, someone hooked me on that saying, do hard things. It's hard to sit down and do your homework and to study for a test. But it's way harder to go to a test having not studied for the test or not done your homework. It's harder to go to school if you haven't done your homework to hand in. Um, and it's hard to get up at 2 a.m. in the morning to get out of bed, get out in the cold and walk to the base of a big alpine route or climb a mountain. Um, but it is crazy rewarding to get to the top and be exhausted at the end of the day and just have a huge smile on your face because your muscles are sore one, two, three days later. Um, you've earned that fun, I think it's fun, soreness feeling. Um, there's all sorts of examples of doing hard things is great for your life. Um, trying things that you thought you couldn't do, whether it's as goofy as a yoga class or rafting down a river or trying rock climbing or trying horseback riding or skiing. If Like you're going to fall snowboarding and skiing your first time and you won't look as good as other people but going and trying it trying and failing maybe um, which is actually just learning um, will make your life better so if I can end with the same thing I started with um, go out there and do hard things it'll make your life better life is hard be hard on yourself and life will be easy on you all the best. I hope I see you guys outdoors, at the rivers, the cliffs, or just out in the woods. Take care.